welcome to a brand new episode of Minecraft Millionaire. Dun, 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 dun. Yeah, boy. So I hope you guys are excited and ready to go because we're going to have one heck of an episode. Uh, it's going to be pretty cool. I'm thinking baller status, like next level. Uh, if you do enjoy the video, you know the routine, guys. I don't gotta tell you every time, but I'll do it anyway. Like, share, subscribe, and favorite, and be sure to follow me on Instagram. I also have Snapchat. Thinking about making a Patreon for a uh, super secret Snapchat. Oh, a really cool stuff that I do. I don't know, maybe. I'm thinking about it. I'm thinking about it, all right? I'm thinking about it. I'm thinking in about it, all right? But, uh, yeah, so let's get started. Woo! Let's do it! Party! Party people! Okay, yeah, I'm done. First things first, guys, I have the stuff to make our Coke, our Coke oven. I'm gonna worry about that in a minute. I'm not doing it right now. Uh, there's, oh, that's what I was gonna do. Okay. Um, before I forget, uh, a couple things I want to show you. I'm pretty excited about it. Uh, I went on and I made this, uh, a little bit lower. Um, now, of course, skeletons are gonna be able to get up here if we do this, but... Yeah, pretty much. I, I forgot about that. Actually, no, I know what to do. Don't worry. This, this, we're fine. We're fine. I know what to do. There, we just put that like that. Now they can't get up here. Plus, I probably just cut off a good portion of the wall. There you go. We just got to put a little torch up here. A little torch -roni, Boom. And now mobs won't spawn. Also, you, we probably need to put some up here. You know what? Just give me a second. We're, we're, we're going to double. We're just going to make sure we got this thing, all right? Of course, dude, we're not going to be out here if it's not nighttime, dude. We're not coming out here. I mean, we're not coming out here if it is nighttime. So we're not, we don't have anything to worry about. So, but just, just in case, just in case. Okay. So what we need to do now is where we're going to put the Coke oven. Now that's okay. I got a couple ideas. I'm thinking we put the Coke oven inside. you saw that? you saw that? Look at that. Little red. Oh, no. Little red spot there. Okay. I'm thinking we put it in this room somewhere, but I don't know. I, I'm really, I, I really don't know, but I, I feel like we need to put it some, you know what? Yeah, we're putting it right here. Uh, okay, not exactly what I was shooting for, but, um, we'll take it. All right, now that I've vein minored out the, 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 the wall, I'm thinking we put the coke oven right here, all right? Yeah, um, yeah, it's gonna go right here. It's gonna look good. Let me see, can I get rid of this too? Yeah! Yeah, we'll talk about that later, dude. We're gonna talk about that. Don't look down there. We're, we're not that part of the video yet, all right? Don't look. Okay, so let's see. So now all we gotta do is gotta put one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. I, I don't think you have to leave one uh, in the middle for this one. I, I don't remember. If we do, I'll, I'll do it. It's no big deal. But I, I really don't recall having to do that. So hopefully. Let's see. And boom. There we go. All right. Got our Coke oven up and running. Uh, and we should be pretty good on all accounts uh, of everything we need to do. All right. We got our Coke oven up. I'm going to go over here. I'm going to close this off. All right. Because I don't want mobs coming in here. There we go. I don't think. Yeah. I'm pretty sure we don't have to put anything special in here to make it work. We just put some uh, some some coal in here. Yeah, there we go. All right, we got the Coke oven up and running. Now, the other thing I need to show you guys, and I think you're going to like it. Remember, guys, we're trying to make money, and we need to make ethanol to make money, so we got a lot of ways to make money, all right? That's all I'm saying. we got a lot of stuff to do, and uh, we're going to get there slow and steady-like, all right? Okay, so uh, how do I how do I show you guys it? I guess we just go, all right? I guess I'll just go up here and show you. So we're going to crawl up here, all right? Now, this is important, guys, so pay attention. I built this, and I'm pretty proud of it, okay? So we built this last episode. It's just a ladder. Nothing, nothing, nothing crazy. It's just a ladder. We like ladders. Ladders are good. All right, so after we get up here, then we got another ladder now. I, I was going to put a rail. I just haven't done it yet, Um, but we'll get there. Okay, now this is where it gets cool, guys. We built this platform last episode or the one before it? I don't remember. So anyway, once we're up here, I built this new tower, all right? And, uh, okay, well, I thought I had a cool tower, but apparently I forgot to put ladders in there. I built it from here up and then teleported down, but I had a, I had a ladder, like one of the, uh, the, like, rope ladders, but I guess they're not, like, infinite anymore. Never mind. Uh, so, uh, but yeah, you get, you get what I'm trying to do here. We're going to put ladders up here and then we're going to be able to go all the way to the top and we're going to make an awesome windmill guys. And the windmill is going to power a squeezer, which is going to give us ethanol. And with ethanol, we're going to be able to make bank, dude. I remember last time I was here, I told you guys we're going to make some bank off the ethanol. Well, let's double check on that. So a bucket of ethanol will make us eight 
$80, $80. So I'm really excited about that. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to get all the pieces that we're going to need. All right. We're going to get all the pieces that we're going to need and we're going to, uh, we're just, I'm going to do, I'm going to, I'm going to, I'm going to get it done. All right. I'm going to get it done. I don't know what, how to, what else to say than other than I'm, I'm going to get it done. Don't worry. Okay. So we'll be right back guys. I'm going to wait till daylight to get anything crazy going on. And, uh, yeah, we'll be, we'll be back uh, when daylight gets here and I'm going to be setting up the next big thing. All right, guys. So I'm up here. I'm trying to get this thing all set up, but I think we're going to be pretty good. Uh, we're almost there, I believe. Um, I think all I've got to do now is just attach the windmill blades. To, and this is the first. Yeah, there we go. So this is just the first one, guys. Uh, we'll have more eventually. Like, I'll have more down there. But uh, this one, the top one is always the one that's going to generate powder, power. So what we got to do to make sure this is working is I need to put a connector on this one. All right. And we can see that it's getting power. And then we need to put a connector on this one. I don't remember if it's blue or orange that accepts uh, power. I think it's blue. It's a super simple thing to find out. We just attach that, and then we attach these, and... Okay, we're good. It's definitely blue. So now the question is this. what? How do we send the power to the next thing? And I'm pretty sure that I can bust a hole in the bottom, and it'll actually send it uh, down the line. So let me see if this works, all right? So we got the blue one, right? Okay, there. Blue, all right. And then we put this on the bottom. Wait a minute, wait a minute, my, uh, dude, I, I totally ma might have made too much stuff, okay? I think there's another way we can go about this, all right? Hold on, I'm trying to figure this out real quick, guys. We got, like, I'm going to make this work, all right? You know what? We could do it this way. We're going to do it this way. We're going to do it the originally way that we uh, we had had it in our head to do, all right? So we're going to put the wire there, all right? Then we're going to run it to this. Okay. Now, all we've got to do now, okay, perfect. Okay, then all we got to do is take one wire here and here. Oh, wait, no, we don't have to do that. Okay, so the next thing I'll have to do, and dude, I'm glad I built it like this because all I've got to do now is I'm going to go down. All right, first thing I'm going to do is, where, wait, which one is it under? Is it under? It's got to be under this one, yeah? Okay, cool. So I'm going to mark that, and then I'm going to go down. Wait, okay, so we're good. All right, so let's say about right right there. Let's see, now nah, a little bit far. No, actually, we're going to put another windmill here, so um, put it like that, boom. Let me put that there, and then boom. Okay, wait, now I gotta go up? I, I guess I gotta go back up because it didn't work? I, I'm not sure what's going on. I'm trying, guys! Uh, so let's see. So And then we run the power to that one, and boom. Okay, so that one's good. We got power running from that one, so it's draining this to send power down there. Okay, I like it. I like it. Um, all right, so I'm going to finish laying these, pi or these wires, and uh, we'll be right back. All right, guys, so check it out. I had to do a lot of stupid stuff. For some reason, our relays aren't working, so I had to make a lot of battery boxes, but I'm not upset about it. What I'm going to do is I'm going to put the squeezer right here, and what the squeezer is going to do is it's going to make the ethanol, okay? So all we got to do is we got to get ready. We got to make the squeezer. Now, I'm not, I don't really remember how to make the squeezer, so I kind of need to get the manual, but I put the manual up a while ago, so... Yeah, I'm going to have to grab that real quick. But after I get the manual, I'm going to go in. I'm going to start setting up the squeezer like right here. And hopefully we can get that going. So we'll be right back as soon as I get all this up and running. All right, boys? So you guys just hold on a little bit longer. And we'll start working with the squeezer. All right? So, um, BRB. All right, guys, so I think I got everything set up. Now, it's a little different than what we've done in the past because the recipe is different, but we're going to try this really quickly. And from what I can tell, it's super simple to make compared to what we did back in the day. Let me make sure we're lined up. Okay, we're good. And then we just put this level here. I could be wrong. I think that maybe, uh, yeah, I was thought I might be wrong. I thought uh, that needs to go here and then that. And this should do it, I think. Okay. Ah, oh, there we go. Boom, got it. And does your squeezer, baby. Got him. Oh, look at that squeezer. Okay, now all we got to do now is we got to power it. And I think the power's on top. Yeah, there's the power. Okay, so all we got to do now. Oh, crap. I left everything inside. So I'm going to run go grab it. We're going to put another one of those over here. One of the connectors. We'll put it right on the top. And it should cut on no problems. Let me go grab my connector. All right, so here goes nothing, guys. Uh, we put that there, and then we right-click that one, and we should... Yep, we're screwed. I gotta grab another one. BRB, guys. Gotta get one more, because I don't have the one for that one. Let me make sure this thing's good. So is that red? Yeah, that's red. What is this one? It's, all right, so we got blue and red. Okay, everything's good, except I gotta get one more. Without further ado, let's squeeze it up. Okay, so, and then, boom. All right, that is on. Uh, birds on a wire. No idea what that means, but the squeezer is being powered. Looks like we're gonna have plenty of power. 
Okay, now the question is what can I put inside of this that will squeeze? So, in order to squeeze stuff, we need to get seeds. I think normal seeds will work. Also, I'm going to put all this stuff up because we don't need it anymore. All right, so I'm just going to find an empty box, which we should have tons up. There we go. I'm just going to put all this stuff in boxes. Um, okay, all we need to do now is I need to grab seeds and see if this will work. Now, here's potatoes. Uh, I definitely can harvest all of the potatoes. Um, I don't think that we can squeeze potatoes. I think the potatoes potatoes are more for fermenting okay uh yeah i know we're getting a little we're getting a little uh we're, we're getting a little bit of that other series but remember guys we're trying to make a lot of money in the game and the best way to do that is to you know squeeze because we'll get 80 dollars per bucket and hopefully we get a lot of buckets if we get a lot of buckets we're gonna be ballers we might have to get more seed production. Like, we're down here, like, maybe put a sprinkler up. A sprinkler would be nice. I think a sprinkler would be a good way to do this. Uh, I could be wrong, but... I, actually, I don't even know if there's a sprinkler in the pack, but... Anyway, hopefully we just got a lot of seeds. Let's see, where are we at? We're at uh, a stack and a half of seeds. Hopefully that's good. If anything, at least we got food still. All right, and then... In goes that. Squeezing. Uh, half a bucket. All right, let's let it run for a minute, guys. Okay, other things that we can need. Now that we got power down here, uh, we'll be able to power anything we need. Um, but we need to make a, a portable tank. Portable tank. All right, we need a portable tank. Where's it at? And boom, portable tank. So that's just glass and copper, all right? We only need one. We don't need a lot of these at all. Actually, it probably wouldn't hurt to have a couple. Uh, as for the buckets, can I pour this milk in the water and make soggy water milk? Yes, you can. Okay, cool. Um... I need a piece of copper, which I, I did have a lot of... Oh, I think it's in the furnace. Uh, copper and glass, all right? And I did have sand. There we go, copper and sand. Oh, wait, wait, there was copper. All right, so let's try this. So, boom, 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 boom. And that should make us... Okay, one, two, three, four. That's good. No more than four, right? That, how's that sound, guys? No more than four sounds good to me. Okay, so also I found some more seeds, so that's good too. So, let's see. So, we'll put the... All right, so we got seven buckets in there, all right? So, boom, I'm going to put those in there. And then I think there's a way to draw this out without, um, there we go. So I got that, got our bucket. And then what we'll do is we'll, I think there's a way to pick these up too. I think I might need a wrench. So I'll make a wrench. Wait a minute. Why is it saying there's eight buckets required? Hold on. Wait, portable tank. Oh, eight bucket. Okay. So I guess we need eight buckets. Yeah, I may have gotten a little bit carried away, boys. Apparently, I shouldn't have made so many tanks. I should have made um, buckets. I should have brought more buckets than tanks. Okay, so this will be three. Four. All right. There we go. I got it. All right, now I got to go grab something real quick. And, oh, wait, wait. Can I just do that? I'm going to break this. Boom. Got it. All right. And then we should be able to turn it in. So, quest and manually submit. Okay, it didn't, it's not taking. It's like, wait a minute. Ah, oh, dang it. I made the, the, dude, I made the wrong thing. I made plant oil. I needed ethanol. No, dang it. I made the plant oil. And I know that I don't get paid for plant oil, dude. No, not like this. I needed ethanol. In order to get ethanol, you have to make uh, the industrial fermenter, dude. No, no. <laughs> Why would you do this to me? Why? Why? Oh my god, dude. I'm so dumb. Okay, so we've got to make the other thing like literally right beside this. This sucks so much. All right, guys, so I got the fermenter going. So hopefully this thing works now. So, uh, I'm making some potatoes. I put in pretty much all of our potatoes. I don't think we're going to have enough, so I'm going to have to run to the chest. I think I've got a couple more potatoes sitting around somewhere. We're not hobbit, so we don't keep potatoes in bulk, but I wish we did. I thought I had more potatoes. I must not. That doesn't mean, like, that, this is just a, like, we're going to have to rob villages type thing. Actually, I have bones, I think. I, I probably could bone mill it, to be honest. All right, let's try this anyway. Let's 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 do this real quick. So we got yeah about six buckets. So we're gonna put this over here. So boom, 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 boom. All right. So there's five buckets, right? So one, two, three, four, 
five. So I've got all the potato stuff done, guys. All we've got to do now is see if we can turn this in. Now, it should turn in this time because we got ethanol, right? Let's double check this real quick. So that should be ethanol. Okay, so let's give it a shot. And ethanol manually submit okay it's not working why are you not working i legit have the ethanol in my hand and it's not accepting it are you kidding me look at this ethanol in a portable tank boom i have no idea guys i i've done everything that it asked if you guys have the answer i would love to know it dudes but i'm so frustrated if you guys uh did enjoy the video uh please don't forget to like share and subscribe uh thank you guys for being awesome and for being ballers so next episode no matter what guys uh we're just gonna keep going with this because we can make jet fuel and stuff like we get this is not bad okay this is not bad we've got a lot of stuff we can do with these two machines okay so we're gonna make it work Anyway, if you did enjoy the video, uh, don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and favorite, and uh, we'll see you in the next one. Thanks for being sexy, beast.